for number 22, we've got this rather bizarre shape. And one thing that I can tell, though, is that as I look at it, each of these increments is going to be equal. So again, these three are equal. These three are equal. Well, in order to find x and y, I'm going to split this up into whatever I can see. Now, first, what I'm noticing is that if I cut off this bottom section down here and look at just the top part, it looks like I've got a triangle with a mid-segment in it. So I can just multiply 17 by 2 to get to x. So 17 times 2 gives me 34. So x is 34. Now, if I cover up the top portion of this, I'm left with a trapezoid that extends here. When I say cut off, I mean just cut off this upper triangle and left with this trapezoid that I've highlighted. Now, again, this one is the mid-segment. I can use the mid-segment and the top base to determine the value or the length of the longer base on bottom. And again, the exact same way we've done before. Average is add and divide by 2. In order to go from the average out, I multiply by 2 and then subtract from seven, or subtract the top one. 34 times 2 is 68. 68 minus 17 is 51. So y is just going to be 51.